This is Sarah. She is 65 years old. Besides her active lifestyle, she suffers from a heart disease, which causes her heart to beat super fast and irregular. This is called atrial fibrillation. Sarah has to take five medications for multiple diseases, but she's not alone in this. Over half of the older population has to take at least five medications a day. This often leads to mistakes, which then increases the risk for falls, hospitalization, bleeding, and even death. How can we help Sarah's doctors to avoid these complications? The key is medication optimization. But how does it work? Well, by asking three questions, we can assess the quality of drug prescribing and identify any mistakes that might have been made. The first question is, can all the drugs Sarah is taking be linked to a disease she has? For example, Sarah is taking antidepressants, but according to her medical record, she does not have depression. Second question is, is Sarah taking all the appropriate medications or are there any missing? So Sarah has atrial fibrillation and she does not take aspirin or another blood clot preventing drug, but it's important that she does. Third, is Sarah taking a combination of drugs that interact badly with each other? If this is the case, we can look for an alternative drug. Performing this medication review is intensive work for which the doctors don't have the time. That's why we want to create a generalized overview of the most common medication mistakes in this specific population group, so that the doctors can easily assess the possible problems in medication use. We will use a large dataset that contains information of more than 200,000 people who, just like Sarah, are 65 years old, suffer from atrial fibrillation and other diseases. We will then use the previous three questions on drug use to analyze the data. Finally, we will have a list of the most occurring medication mistakes. With this list, the doctor and even Sarah herself can check if there are problems with her medical treatment so that Sarah can keep enjoying an active lifestyle. Thank you.